All right, so welcome back to part two of my uh, expensive scanner review. So we saw what the scanner does, and let me show you what accessories it comes with. So this is the box that it came with. Really great hard shell uh, box. Um, it's really kept my purchase together all these years. And let me go over the different adapters that it came with. So uh, it came with these adapters, these big legacy adapters from Mercedes-Benz, BMW, right? Uh, Kia, GM, OBD2 port, that's what I'm normally using, Nissan, Honda, Toyotas, this is the BMW uh, legacy connector right there if you're working on older cars, uh, came with jumper, uh, jumper setup so in case you need to draw power from uh, the battery direct instead of the OBD2 port, came with the software, right, uh, for uh, for the printing and different reporting you can do uh, but a really great uh, unit I'll have a link to this below and let me know what you guys think what kind of experiences you guys have had with some of these more expensive scanners as I said I still love my little scanner and I use it most of the time but uh, when it comes down to something a little more advanced troubleshooting these big scanners do really help out and uh, they pay for themselves in a matter of 10 to 15 uses you're, you've gotten your money back and it makes customers really happy so if you have a shop or a, a, a upholstery shop mechanic shop any kind of work around cars you definitely want to get one of these thanks for watching guys love to hear your comments give the video a thumbs up if you guys liked it and uh, hit the subscribe button have a great day